Hi, are you getting a playback failed, no match recorded file error on your Hikvision CCTV DVR? No problem. Today I'm going to show you how to fix the problem. First of all, check and ensure that the system date and time of your DVR is current. If it is different, change it to read the correct time and date in your region. The second thing you need to do is to check if the CMOS battery has expired. If your DVR has been operating for more than three years with the same CMOS battery, then perhaps it is time to change it. The battery is located in the position shown here. It is a tiny, shiny, silver looking disc and has a number inscribed on it. Take note of this number as you will need it when buying a new battery. To change the battery, you have to first remove the cover of the DVR. To do this, switch off the power to the DVR and remove the cover. Use a small screwdriver to remove the CMOS battery. Be careful not to damage the socket as this may create more problems for you. Replace the battery with a new battery of the same number which you had jotted down. Once you are done, return the cover of the DVR and restart your DVR. Check if the DVR is now recording. If the battery was a problem, your DVR should start recording immediately. If the problem was not resolved, you need to check the hard disk. Depending on the type of DVR you have, go to the menu and select the appropriate command for checking the hard disk. For the HIC vision, go to the main menu dashboard and select HDD. Check the status of your disk here. If it indicates abnormal, then you need to initialize it. Before initializing your hard disk, ensure that you do not have crucial data in the hard disk that you may require because it will be erased. To initialize the hard disk, click on the tiny box as indicated here. Then navigate to the bottom of the page and click on the button INIT or initialize. Restart your DVR when the initialization is complete. Check if the DVR has started recording. If the hard disk does not work, even after formatting it, or if it is spoiled, replace it with a new one and hopefully the DVR will finally work. If none of the above works, we suggest that you get a new DVR. I hope this helps. Thank you.